Hey folks, this is Vincent Adelie with Dad's Gaming Addiction, and today we're going to check out Truck Off. This is a game that supports two to six players. It's for ages eight and up, and the average playtime is about 30 minutes. This just came in the mail uh, as part of a press demo kit that I got, so this is going to be our first time playing. We did read the rules, but be aware there may be a rules goof or two. I did cover this game a while ago. It was uh, back when it was on Kickstarter, and it doesn't look like the overall premise has changed much, it shouldn't have. But that goes to show you, some really cool games come out of Kickstarter, so um, I'm, I'm glad to see that. Anyway, what are you doing in this game? Each player is a food truck company. You're going to be assigning your food trucks to these venues. The venues that are available depend on the number of people that are playing the game. In a two-player game, as you see here, there's four venues. Each venue has a matching die. These dies determine how much this venue will pay out every round. So if this says 12 or 10, whatever, that'll pay out 10 for that round, 10 for that round, this will pay out 6 for this round, and so on. So uh, during a typical round, what you're going to do, you start off with um, the food trucks. The, you've got a 10 matching that one, a 12 matching that one, 20 matching that one, and an 8 matching this one. And again, there's other food trucks in the box for if you have more players in more venues. But anyway, so you're going to choose two of them secretly so that no one else knows what they are. And everyone, when everyone's do, done doing that, they're going to go ahead and reveal them and then place them under their respective venue. So let's say Idly chose these two. Again, it's going to be hand-picked, not random. It's a bad example. Let's try that one, 10. Okay. So once players have revealed their food trucks and put them underneath the appropriate venue, um, then they'll get to choose what action cards they, each player has their own hand of action cards. Okay, there's more in the box for the different colors, but I, here's my action cards for teal, her action cards for red. And at the beginning of the game, uh, players are going to remove the same two from their decks. And the manual suggests if you want less of a take that element, um, you'd want to get rid of, say, venue is shut down, or anything. I think there's a couple in here. Truck is shut down. That might be another one. Uh, those two, I believe, are the harshest one out of the entire deck. So you can remove those, and everyone else removes those from their decks, and just removes them from the game. And then you're left with a hand of action cards. And during, during that phase, you're going to choose the action cards you want to play. Let's say I choose to play three of them. The rest go off to the side. And then starting with the starting player, you're going to take turns going back and forth, playing these action cards and affecting the trucks or affecting the payouts, moving things around, what have you. And then when you're all done with that, then uh, each venue will pay out based on the die that is currently showing. And the payout is split across each player. So let's say that this is a 10. There's two here. So that would be five for her and five for me. This is a six. There's only one person here. So uh, she would get six for this venue. There's a seven here and there's only one truck here. So I would get seven for that venue. And here's the money in the middle of the table. These are special tokens that correspond with some of these special action cards that are played. And I believe that's it. You're going to do that for five rounds. You take your trucks back. And you're going to do this for five rounds, and whoever's the most money wins. Now, that rule set, that brief rule set I just explained to you, is for three plus players. There's a separate rule set for two players. There is going to be a third imaginary AI player named Barry, who has the same food trucks that everyone else does. Starts with 20 money, and each round, uh, one player is going to randomly choose these trucks and when everyone reveals their trucks, they'll assign them as appropriate. So basically, these are just filler trucks so that basically it clutters up the board a little bit. Um, but Barry does not play cards or anything like that, but he does receive payouts. And then at the end of the game, if Barry wins by having those money, so be it. Uh, another difference with the two-player game is that instead of having a hand of action cards, is that water running? Yeah, I think he's taking a shower. Of course he is. He has to choose now to take a shower. So apologies if you can hear that in the background, folks. But anyway, instead of each player having a hand of cards, you're going to shuffle them together, get rid of eight of them, 
and then put them out in the grid as specified by the rule book. So for example, we'll just do that now since we're playing the two player variant. I'm actually, and you're supposed to randomly discard, but I do want to get rid of the ones that are take that. So truck is shut down. That's not that. <coughs> Bless you, there's our obligatory sneeze for the- I was the... doing so well. No you weren't. <laughs> really? No you weren't. No, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> Alright, so these two, okay, so those are the red ones. And place another truck, reroll, double payout, reroll, truck is shut down. Uh, move another truck, venue is shut down. So again, what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to take these cards, shuffle them together, and get rid of eight at random. Instead of the eight at random, I'm getting four that I'm handpicking to get rid of that, take that element. It's not in the rule book. But I'm going to do it because, it, you know, it just makes sense. If you can do it in a three-plus player game, you should be able to do it in a uh, two-player game as well. So now I'm just going to take out, say, these four, whatever. So now there's our eight that we took out of the game. And now I have to look in the rule book. The grid is four on the bottom. These are face up. And the way this is going to work is every round, instead of us picking cards out of our hand to play... We're going to play two cards per round in a four-player game, or in a two-player game, rather, there's only four rounds instead of five. Uh, whoops, there's that. K, 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 and then there's three here. One, two, three. Mm -hmm. So it's sort of like a kind of pyramid kind of thing. Yeah. And every, every round, what's going to happen is, instead of us picking cards to play from our hand, uh, whoever has the first player token will choose a card that is revealed, not covered up. Then I'll choose one, then she chooses one, then I choose one. Each player does that twice per round, and then over four rounds, these should all disappear. Mm -hmm. That's the main difference between a uh, two-player game and a three-plus player game. You're going to have a, in a two-player game, you're going to have an uh, uh, AI player, uh, and you're, in a two-player game, you're going to have this grid, um, and not a hand of cards. So I think we're ready to go, and then hopefully... What, what hmm? do these numbers mean? Oops, sorry. I don't think the numbers really mean anything. Oh. I could be wrong about that, but, um, yeah. I'm, I'm looking here, and I don't see... Oh, I was just curious. Yeah. I mean, if it does mean something, it's a rules goof, and I'm sure we'll... Yeah. So, here's a quick look at the rest of the components in the box. Daily special cards are like an advanced game that you can play. Uh, basically, these change the way... What you're going to do is you're going to remove uh, the ones that don't... Like, this is yellow. There's a yellow... Like, here's the city center. Six-sided die six-sided die here. So you're going to remove all the one, all these cards that aren't in the, uh, all these venues that are not in the game, you're going to remove the matching cards that go along with that. But basically, these change the way that certain things will behave every round. Okay, so this is an advanced variant. Uh, here's the rest of the components that we didn't use. There's a yellow die there, a six-sided and a four-sided die, other food trucks belonging to other players, these are the other decks belonging to the other players uh, that we're not using other colors. Oh, maybe this is how much it costs to play a card? No. Uh -huh. mm -mm. <laughs> That's an interesting thought, though. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what that 1 and 3 and all that stuff is. It doesn't actually say. Weird. Mm-hmm. So, all right, well, let's give this a spin. Um, but that's an interesting idea, though, paying to actually play a card. It might make the game a bit more interesting. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. It just says when you're selecting actions, um, there's no limit to the number of action cards a player may select, um, execute actions. Really? So we can just use this whole pyramid? Well, no, in a regular three-plus player game. Well, what about two-plus? Two player, in a two-player game, it's... One, 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 one. Remember, oh, it's four oh, per round. Two. Okay. Yeah. So, all right. Well, let's go ahead and give it a go. Um, who was the last to eat? And it's the last person that ate from a food truck. But I've never eaten from a food truck. Really? I've never eaten. From I a food ate truck. it from an ice cream truck. Well, there you go. Food <laughs> truck. Yeah. Have you ever had an ice cream? Yeah, I've had ice cream. I was a kid. <laughs> okay. So now we're going to select. Our trucks. So just choose two of them. Here's your trucks. Here's my trucks. 
I'm going to secretly pick two. Um, I'll choose whatever, these two. Okay. And I'm going to choose two at random for the computer here. He is apparently fry hard. And then I'm the great Freeholio. Is that it? <laughs> and you are Figtown. Figtown? Sure. Okay. <laughs> What is it? Freeholio? Free the Great Freeholio. Okay. F R I J O L I O. Wait. All right. So these are so these are the ones that we picked, right? So now we reveal them. 2012. 2012. Great. Stupid Barry. <laughs> okay. So we have. I'm gonna move these up slightly. Everyone's on 20. <laughs> Everyone's on 20. It's because gaming, man. Yeah, gaming. Exactly. Eight, twelve, and twelve. Okay. So something like that. And now we roll each die. Can you be under you? It doesn't matter. Oh, I don't know. What was it? Oh, wait. Let me try it again. What was it before? Nine? I have no idea. Whatever. Five. I hate... I can't read the dice. All right, there's five. Whatever. Um, eight. Four. And one. Oh, my gosh. Ouch. Okay. So, now that that's done... Now we select our actions. Now you're first player, so you can choose one of these available three. I'm gonna re-roll. You're gonna re-roll. Yeah. Okay, so go ahead and re-roll. Which the green one? I yeah. take it. You wanna? Or you you can roll it. That way you can't blame me if you roll bad. One. Okay. See. Never rolling again. Yes. <laughs> so I'll just put this off to the side. Now I'll play an action. Uh, I can place another truck. Um, here, double your truck's payout, which. A truck is one of these, right? Yes. Okay. I'm going to do, um, uh, yeah, I'm going to double your truck's payout. I'm going to go ahead and play that card. Yes. And it's going to put a times two token here. Okay. And now you can choose a card. Okay. Um, There's place another truck, move your truck, trigger a venue payout. When you trigger a venue payout, mm -hmm. you pay it as it is. Like if I were to pay this one out right now, I would get money for this, the truck goes away, this goes away. But if anyone moves here later, it's possible that it could be paid again. That's for... There's a way to, like if you moved, if someone moved their truck okay. after I did that to this location, it would pay out at the end of this round. Okay. Again, so it's possible for a venue to pay twice. Weird. Alright, um... Um, I'll place another truck. Okay, so you're going to place another truck? Yeah. Alright, and where do you want to put one of your trucks? I see what you're doing there. And the last card, um, I can move my truck. Um, do I really... I'm going to... I'm going to move my truck. Wow. Well, see, I would get, there would be one and one, see, if I move this one, I'm just going to move it, see, if I move it here, then it's no sense, in, I'm, I'm competing with myself, so I'm going to move here, but that would give each player two anyway, so it wouldn't matter. All right, I'm just, I'll leave it. Okay, I'm just the math. I'm yeah. doing the math. Okay, so now that we're, we've chosen two, uh, two apiece, mm -hmm. now we resolve our payouts. Okay. So this one, you get one. Sure. <laughs> one coin. One coin. This one gets four, but it's so two for Barry and two for me. So he starts off with 20 and yes. we start off with none? Correct. That's because he can't make intelligent decisions. Okay. Whatever. So, this is going to be times two. Now, that times two, is that for me or is that for everybody? Double know. your truck. Oh, I think it's double your truck's payout. It says double your truck, not the venue. So, uh, so I, but you would still, so basically the way this works is it would be uh, eight split between two is four a piece. Okay. And then I get times two is eight. So, I get eight, you get four. So if you want to give me, well, here's five, or here's four here, and I get eight. So I'll take a three, 
a three and two ones. Okay. Mm -hmm. And Barry, oh, I'm sorry, we're still on. We're on this one. Yeah, we're on this one, right. So two and two. So Barry gets two and you get two, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. And that ends the first round. So this goes back to Barry. Do we spend our money on it? No, I don't believe so. Oh, I think so we just stack? It, as far as I, I mean, I didn't see it in the rule book. I, I've been over it three times. And I didn't see, I didn't see any paying going on. Like, I didn't see, mm. yeah. Yeah, I, I, I honestly don't see anything here for that. Again, this is our first time playing, but that would be a cool variant. Which isn't listed in the rule book, but it, that, that's possible. Mm -hmm. I don't see why we couldn't do something like that. All right, so now we're on round two. And um, I guess the first player token moves to me. And now we choose two again. So I'll do, say, that one. And let's do... And these cards stay, like, they, they don't get refilled? Correct. Oh, wow. So I'm choosing these two. I'm going to go ahead and choose. Actually, you can do it this time. Tell me, or just, which one do you want? Which mm -hmm. ones do you want? For him? For Barry, yeah. That one. Mm -hmm. And which one? That one. Okay. All right. And then whatever two you want. Okay. Got it? Yeah. Okay. So let's go ahead and reveal them. What do you do? Oh. Oh, okay. There's one. <laughs> When I was like, okay. I thought we were going to do it at the same time. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> well, there are. I can't change mine, obviously. All right, 10 and 20. Okay. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now we go ahead and if you want to roll those two dice, I'll just roll these two dice, make it easier. Three mm -hmm. and two. It's pretty crappy. 12 and two. 12 and so. Tw so 20 is the big payout here. All right, so now, starting with me, I choose a card. Um, I can re-roll. I can double your truck's payout, which... Um, trigger a, pay, a payout now. How do you place a venue point? What do you mean? How do you place one of those? Venue promo? Yeah. Uh, there's a... Um, promote a venue. But how do you get it if this one's in the way? We'll be taking these cards. It, we won't... What do you mean? Because this one says trigger it. Yeah, trigger... You just... Trigger means... If I were to take this now, mm -hmm. I choose a venue to pay out. Let's say I choose this one. Okay. These go away. We each get six. And That's the round it. continues. That's all it means. It pays out earlier than what the rule book... The normal process. That's all it means. But it could pay out again later if this got moved over here. Oh. And it would pay out again at the end of the round. Okay, I see, I see. This is just a way to trigger something sooner rather than later. I see, I see, I think. <laughs> it's, I, it's, it's our first time plan. Yeah. Um, I'm going to double your truck's payout on this one. Mm -hmm. Okay, and now you get to pick one. <laughs> There's a re-roll yeah. and trigger a venue payout, which not a whole lot of choice there. Yeah. I don't, can I like pass? <laughs> uh, in the three plus you could, but oh. in two you have to choose one. Wow. But there's one you definitely want to do, I think. I don't want to do any of these. Yes, you do. I don't because you're going to choose something and you're going to mess me up. <laughs> um. and, but, and there's two cards, so either, either one, it doesn't matter. Um, here's what I'll do then. Oh, dog. There's nothing to whine about. There's no reason to whine. There's not. I know. Man, I guess I'll just re roll this one. Uh, you're gonna re roll the orange one, I take yeah. it? Yeah. Okay. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> Eight. Well, there you go. Okay, so I will um, move other players' truck, mm -hmm. and I am going to move it here. 
And... No, it's my turn. Yeah, you get the final card, so which is trigger a venue payout. That's so stupid. Yeah, so which which venue do you want to pay out? It doesn't, it doesn't even matter at this point. Did you use two? And this is yes. my second one. Mm -hmm. it, so it doesn't matter. Um, just this one, I guess. All right, so you would get... Well, you would get eight. Four, four. So mm -hmm. you would get eight total. Mm -hmm. um, so if you want to grab... Uh, you have two? Yeah, I'll give you ten. Okay, so you triggered that. Okay, so now we're going to trigger them in order. Uh, three for... What's his face? Barry. Uh, one apiece. One for me and one for Barry. It's a pretty crappy one. Mm -hmm. And... That one's going to net you a lot of money. Yeah, so this is 12 times 2 is 24. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to take 25 and turn in 1. Okay. Alright, so now we're on round 3. Mm -hmm. And now we choose, again, which ones at random... Well, not random, but which ones we want to put down. Sure. And then I'll go ahead and do. All right. So, do you care which ones I choose? No. I'll just choose these two. Mm -hmm. Fine. All right. So there's those two. Those two. So whenever you're done, just um, and you get this. Um. Good. Mm -hmm. Okay. There we go. Look at you. <laughs> 20, 10, 12, 8, 12. Okay. Nice job. Okay. So if you want to roll those two, I'll roll these two. That's fine. Man, these are crappy. Ow. Two and two. Oop. And that's a six. 19. 19. Well, someone's going to score big. I don't know. Okay, so you get to go first. I get to move something? Well, you can either move up another tr player's truck or re-roll. I'm going to move another player's truck. <laughs> okay, you're going to move this one, aren't you? Yes. I'm going to move it. Or do you want to move the green and have all black to yourself? No, it's fine. Okay. <laughs> move that one. You don't care about Barry. Yeah. Is here I take it, or do you want to move it here? It doesn't matter, so I guess I'll move it there. Here? Yeah, because it'll be one either way. No, it wouldn't. Why? Here, I would get a total of three points at the end. Why? Two for this one, one for this one. Because this is two. Barry would get one, I would get one. Oh. Here, I get two still. But if I go here, all I get is two. Yeah, no, no. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. That was nice of you. Uh huh. <laughs> I feel like you're gonna like right. stab me back though. Place another truck. Um, Reroll. Yeah, I, I, I kind of like the idea of placing another truck. Um, or rerolling. See, if I reroll this, I could get more. Just straight up points. And then even if you chose. See, okay, um, yeah, I'm going to do that, actually. I'm going to re-roll. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to re-roll this one. Oh. Two. Oh, great. That's great. <laughs> one, I got a one, well, two in ten chance of rolling that, you know, and, yeah, worse or equal. <laughs> All right, you get to go, and then I do one more. Okay. I'm going to... Didn't work out the way I wanted Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Move your truck, promote a venue, move, place another truck. Yeah, sorry. Um, no, no, you're fine. Just telling that for the benefit of the folks at home that are watching. So silly. Um... <laughs> I guess I will, I'm going to promote a venue. Okay. Um, so which venue do you want to promote? This one or this one? Because that, those are the two that are, yeah. And this, it would be double the dice points? No, it's, 
if there's one truck here at that location, mm -hmm. it's whatever this number is plus one. Plus one. If there's two trucks at a location, it's whatever this number is plus four. So you can either get an extra point here or four extra points here. Or you can add to mine. It's up to you. <laughs> um, I know I'm funny. Thing is, if I do that, I'll do it here. Okay. And I'll leave this card here just to remind us. But okay. And then last card. Uh, I can move my truck. I can. I'm gonna place. Well, yeah. Cause then I could. Okay. I'm gonna play that. And I'm going to place my 20 here. Mm -hmm. Okay. So now we resolve. Um, Barry here gets two points or two money. Mm -hmm. um, I get two for this one. Big deal. You get uh, six plus one is seven. Mm -hmm. So go ahead and take uh, this five and there's, whoop. <laughs> throw in money. And lastly, uh, so 18 divided by 3 is 6, mm -hmm. so we each get 6. And then the remainder is gone. So we'll just do two threes for Barry, two threes for me. Mm -hmm. And you got your, your 6? Yep. Okay. All right. So you get this back, this back, I get these back. And this goes away? That goes away. Uh-huh. Uh, So this is the last round. Mm -hmm. um, we're going to just choose choose our two that we're going to do. Now I'll choose this one and uh, do something different. No, sure. I'll regret it. And then Barry here. Um, go ahead and pick whatever one you want. Those two? Mm -hmm. That one? That one. Okay. <laughs> That's fine. No, keep, keep it honest. Keep it honest. All right, did you pick your two? Yeah. All right, here we go. Ready? Boom, done. Look at that. Always with the 20s. <laughs> 20, 20, 12, 12, 10, and 8. No? Good. Okay, so now we'll roll these dice. You can roll those two if you want. 4, 3, 10, ten and eight, 9. 9. Yep. It's a 9? Yep. The little dot underneath oh, it tells you. Okay. Okay, so now, um, starting with me, mm -hmm. um, I'm going to, I think I'm going to place another truck. And I'm going to try and get as much as I can out of that. <laughs> All right, so your turn. You can re-roll or move your truck. I'm going to re-roll. You're going to re-roll, okay. Yeah. Smart, because underneath that is place another one. Yeah. <laughs> so which one are you going to re-roll? I'm going to re-roll... <laughs> Man. Might as well re the black one? Yeah, okay, go for it. Well. Mm -hmm. We're both there, so it really doesn't matter. Unless we're just aiming to beat Barry. Probably could have re-roll yours though. If you want to. <laughs> well, it's on a four, so there's I'd get, there's a half fifty fifty chance I would get something better than four. Oh really? Well, there's only eight. There, this is an eight sided die. Oh. So I'm like halfway. Good. I'm I'm exactly halfway. Let's see. Eight. Oh, one okay, less. one less. Oof. What? That's less math. <laughs> okay, so now move your truck. Um, do I have to? I think I can. Can I just pass, or do I have to move it? Um, like I don't want to move it. You got to move it. Move it. I I knew that was coming. Move it. <laughs> um, it doesn't say in a two-player game if you have to do it or not. Let's see. Um, two-player rules. Looking. Yeah, it doesn't say. Immediately executing one action. To See, it doesn't say. I mean, in the, in the three plus, it says you can you can players can choose not to. Two. The, 
I'll save this for the first impressions. Okay, so I'll just, I'll, I'll honor the rules and it's not mentioned, so we'll go ahead and I'll move mine. Um, I'll move this eight. And what's the lesser of the two evils here? Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I mean, I'm just here, I guess. Okay, so you get that place another truck. Okay. And then where do you want to put it? I shall put it... Here. Okay, four points, easy. All right, so now we resolve. You get four points for that one. Back that one. Uh, one apiece for me and Barry. Ten, that's three apiece. So three. Actually, let's get some change going here. Mm -hmm. um, three, three, three. One is ten. So I'm going to take a ten. And this three, five, and twos, that's another ten. So that was it three, three, and three, right? Three, three, three. So one, two, three. Mm -hmm. And lastly, four and four. So three, three, one, one. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I think, and that ends the game. I forgot to move this down last time. Mm -hmm. um, and I guess... I think you won this big time. <laughs> I got four. No, you did good. Um, that's three, six. Okay, so I have uh, 51. Wow, I have 39. <laughs> That's good. It's not too bad. 39, it's not bad. So what did you think? How much did Barry have? Did he oh, win? Barry, no, he <laughs> lost. Oh, okay. uh, Barry had... Um, Barry probably won, I think. Well, here's 10, so 33, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40. Really? Yeah. I thought he had more than that. Wow, good job. You even beat the AI. I, lucky me. <laughs> it was that one that I had at times two that really did it for me. Yeah, that did. That was it. Um, so what did you think? Honestly, yeah. I will be brutally honest. Okay. I absolutely hated it. I, okay. <laughs> I'm not, I don't. I don't want to say I hated it, but there are a number of things that I would change about it. Like just because I was at ends first off, trying to figure out, you know, why don't we just instead of including, instead of having this grid, mm -hmm. why don't we just have our own hands of cards yeah. and choose what we want to play, and, and like have the same rule set for two and three player, like two two player plus one of the same rules. The only what we could do with the two player variant is add Barry and add the trucks to add more to it just at random. I would add these cards. This is so limited. The like, daily specials? Uh yeah, I would add everything cuz this is just it needed more venues, it needed more trucks, it needed mm. something to spend these on. Yeah. It was just very constrained this game. Yeah. It was it's very basic. It's more for family. That's another thing. I don't like the insinuation of the um you know what I'm talking about. I don't. The the truck off. Oh, title. oh yeah. And with yes. every single company starting with an F word. I didn't notice that. Mm -hmm. How'd you really? Yeah. <laughs> I didn't I didn't catch that. Well, these are Fs. Uh, what about the other ones? This is oh no, this is Sashimi rolling. Oh, okay. Okay, okay so you're fine. Oh, thank goodness. Yeah. Well, you, you only took the ones that started. Hey, I chose <laughs> those colors, okay? I like the colors. That's the ones I chose. Okay. One okay. issue that I thought might be... I, I think the turn or the round order could be different. First, we select our trucks, and then we roll the dice. I would rather roll the dice first, see what's going to pay out. Yeah. Then we strategically pick what trucks we're going to put on what venue. So let's say that this was this rolled a 20, this rolled a 12, this rolled um, an 8, and this rolled a 4. If there, Let's say there's three or four people playing. Mm -hmm. With this being a 20, now it becomes a one, I wonder what everyone else is going to do. Yeah. 
this is a 20, so everyone's going to go here. So let's say there's four people playing. If all four people go here, that's five apiece. Mm -hmm. Whereas I might go, well, if everyone's going to jump in on that action, I might decide to play the eight instead, and I'll get eight points instead of five split mm -hmm. between everyone. I like rolling the dice first. I like that better than after mm -hmm. selecting your trucks. That's just me. That's something I would change. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's not bad, but I, there's, there's a number of things that I don't agree with with this game. I just, I don't know, it's, it's not, I, I like the idea, it's like Lemonade Tycoon, like for the PC. Like, I like the idea, I like the theme, mm -hmm. and I think the, the colors and, and the dice matching the colors and everything, like, that's cool. I like that. Um, I didn't, and another thing is, the two-player game with the grid makes the strategy a lot different than you would having your own hand of cards too. With a grid, you actually see people like you it's it's open information. Mm -hmm. So you you can limit what your opponent gets if you play the cards right. If you select the ones and, and you lock your opponent into something that they don't want. Whereas if you had your own hand of cards and you were playing, you'd have more control over what bonuses were played. And, so and it's, it'd be secret. It'd be yeah, secret, secret too, secret right. So it, it's know. just, I don't, I mean, I would, I would have that grid as an alternate variant that two players could do. I would keep the rules as is with a two-player game. Get rid of the grid, add a third player just to randomly seed this. I would add the grid and do the hand of cards so that way you pick one from your hand of cards and one oh, that's a thought this. yeah mm -hmm. so you could choose a deck that's not being used like the white deck or the and uh, the two decks that are not being used like the white deck and the black whatever deck mm -hmm. and then you would deal out the grid and then i so i would choose one from here choose one from the grid mm -hmm. i like that idea that's cool there's a lot of ways that this could have been played. I, I, I like the idea. It's just the execution that's just terrible. Yeah. I think. No, no. <laughs> it's fair. That's why, that's why I do this, you know. So, anyway, that was Truck Off. Um, if you guys haven't already, feel free to subscribe to my Twitch and YouTube channels. That way you can stay up to date with any new content I've been to publish. This is Vincent Ida Lee. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you guys next time. Bye, guys.